Greetings to you, fellow bird lovers, and a warm welcome to homebirdfeeder.com. Today, we're diving deep into an intriguing topic that has many bird watchers curious. Do hummingbirds open their beaks when they feed? Get ready to be enlightened. The big question, do hummingbird beaks open? Contrary to popular belief, hummingbirds don't keep their beaks shut all the time. They actually open them, and not just for sipping nectar, but also to catch insects and spiders, providing them with essential protein. A varied diet is absolutely crucial for their high energy lifestyle. The anatomy of a hummingbird's beak. Ever wondered what makes up a hummingbird's beak? It's divided into two main parts. The upper part, or maxilla, which is rigid and slightly curved. The lower part, the mandible, which is more flexible. This design enables them to delve deep into flowers and also catch insects with ease. Diversity in hummingbird's beak lengths. There are over 350 hummingbird species, each with its unique beak length. While most hummingbirds have beaks ranging between 15 mm and 25 mm, the astonishing sword-billed hummingbird boasts a beak longer than its body, ranging from 80 to 120 mm. Hummingbirds' feeding habits and functionality. These marvelous creatures use their long beaks and specialized tongues to extract nectar from flowers efficiently. But don't be fooled. Their beaks also serve as effective traps, snatching insects and spiders to diversify their diet with much-needed protein. The evolutionary marvel of hummingbirds' nature always finds a way. Over time, hummingbird beaks have evolved, adapting to their environment and survival needs. Longer and more flexible beaks are believed to have evolved to extract nectar from deeper flowers and enhance insect catching abilities. Hummingbirds versus other birds. When compared to other birds, the design and functionality of the hummingbird's beak stand out. Their beaks are a testament to nature's meticulous attention to detail, making them some of the most efficient feeders in the avian world. Caring for hummingbird. Like any other creature, hummingbirds can sometimes suffer from beak damage. If you come across one in distress, it's essential to contact a local wildlife rehabilitation center or avian veterinarian. They'll know the best ways to assist these delicate wonders. There's so much wonder in our world, from majestic mountains to these tiny, vibrant hummingbirds. So, the next time you're out in your garden, take a moment to marvel at these beautiful creatures. You never know, you might even see one open its beak wide. Thanks for joining us today on homebirdfeeder.com. If you found this video enlightening, don't forget to check out our other videos on the mysteries of hummingbird flight. Until next time, happy bird watching everyone, and as always, thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.